Welcome to this series on mastitis in dairy cows brought to you by the University of Edinburgh. This video is the cleaning and disinfecting milking equipment. Mastitis is the infection of the milk producing gland, the udder. Bacteria invade the teat end via the teat canal and cause an infection. Mastitis is a fight between bacteria invading the udder and the cow fighting the infection. Good standards of hygiene are of the utmost importance for the quality of milk and its products as well as for the producers since milk price is often dependent on quality. To clean milking containers and utensils, the aim is to ensure that the residues are removed. Remember, bacteria do not like lack of food, lack of moisture, and daylight. Separate the utensils into two different groups, those that are used in the dairy and those that have been used where the cows are. Clean the dairy equipment fast as it would only have been in touch with milk. Buckets that have sat on the ground may have been in contact with cow manure. You require three troughs or buckets of water for cleaning. A bucket of cold or warm water with a duck brush. A bucket of warm water about 40 to 50 degrees with a white brush with a suitable dairy detergent added. And a bucket with 10 to 15 liters of cold water to which has been added the right quantity of disinfectants. The water plus the duck brush. Use the duck brush and water only for the outside of the utensils to be cleaned. Clean next to the trough so that the dirty water can run away immediately. This duck brush is possibly coming into contact with where there might have been soil or cow manure and should be kept out of any milk touching surfaces at any time. The water plus white brush plus detergent. Use the white brush and detergent water only for the inside surfaces of the milk utensils. Clean the dairy equipment first and the bucket second. The water goes back into the trough after being used. The water plus disinfectant. Put the wash utensils into the disinfectant water. Make sure all surfaces are in contact with the disinfectant. Allow to dry upside down and well ventilated. 